Hey guys, welcome to Joint Face to Face again. It's Justin and Gerald, and we're reporting Yo. some uh, important news from the Baltimore Ravens. Uh, there's a source that told ESPN that Kenneth Dixon uh, tore his meniscus, is going to undergo surgery, so he's likely going to miss, if not the whole season, most of it. Uh, so they signed, they're going to sign Bobby Rainey, is what the source is telling us, uh, to fill, I guess, the third string running back position. So what do you think about this, Gerald? What does this do to the backfield? Well, I mean, it's a hit to the backfield that's already been struggling years past. So it's going to be interesting to see what happens. I'm a little pissed off because Kenneth Dixon obviously got some usable yardage last year. Unfortunately, now we have to go without him. But Rainey should be able to pick up the reins. Yeah, no pun intended. <laughs> and we should be able to go from there. Um, it'll be interesting to see where the Ravens go from here. I would I of course was looking forward to a very strong running game to balance out Joe Flacco's passing game. But we'll have to see how the playbook goes. Yeah, the Ravens were already gonna start the season without Dicks in the first four weeks, I believe, because of the suspension. So now, you know, they maybe missed him the whole year instead. But they already be, had to be prepared to go without him in the first place. I think Bobby Rainey coming in uh, is a good insurance policy on Woodhead because uh, Rainey has proved, uh, when he, yeah. especially when he's on the Giants, that he can handle a receiving back kind of role. Um, hey. He's also a good special teamer. Um, so, But I think the back will be fine because Woodhead is a very underrated signing for the Ravens. You know, They definitely needed someone that's going to fill more of that Ray Rice void. Uh, oh, yeah. Out. Oh. I mean, you know how uh, Joe Flacco like to do the checkdowns with Ray Rice, so it's going to be yeah. And Woodhead. Danny Woodhead's the perfect target for him. So, like I said, I don't see this being a big deal, but I mean, not a big deal. I don't, I don't mean that in any shape or form. But it'll be interesting to see what happens. Kenneth Dixon, of course, was a big part of the rushing game last year. Yeah. So now, I guess most of that void is going to be filled by Terrence West now, uh, who <laughs> was capable last year. So you know, maybe he'll keep it going this year. Uh, and then Woodhead will handle the receivings. That's kind of what we expect. Um, but it'll be interesting. Uh, definitely want to see these guys in preseason and see how they do. Yes, I am so stoked for football. It's going to be awesome. Stay tuned.